Climate shutdown is almost certain to hit this weekend. It's definitely a Washington DC decision, but the effects will be felt locally because the community is so tied together with Fort Drum. Here's 7 News reporter Zach Grady. From travel to taxes to the troops, the likely shutdown of the federal government will have a lasting effect in Washington and the North Country. This could be devastating for our state. Kids could go hungry, troops won't get paid, and the work of the critical federal agencies that make sure our food and water are safe could go undone. In New York State alone, more than 40,000 military personnel will not get paid, almost half of those soldiers being stationed at Fort Drum. I think it'll have a significant effect, I think, on a lot of businesses are going to notice it. When you figure, I mean, we've got just on Fort Drum alone, uh, roughly 19,000 paychecks, military and civilian folks on, on payroll at Fort Drum, not to mention other federal jobs that are in the community. Zembeck says those getting a paycheck from the federal government are not the only ones to see the ripple effects of the shutdown. A lot of the other, the, the purchases that Fort Drum is making from local vendors, it might be for office supplies or other services, but you know, there's some of that, that spending too that's going to be curtailed. The military will not be the only federal agencies to be hurt by the government holdup. TSA agents will also be going without pay, slowing down air travel, while nutritional programs like WIC and SNAP could be completely stopped. There is a scheduled vote for Saturday in the U.S. House of Representatives, but it remains unclear what that vote is about. Republican Speaker of the House Kevin McCarthy says he feels it's not the end yet for getting a deal done, but must unite a divided GOP party to do so. Zach Grady, 7 News.